identify this object? Yes, Clico. This is a good part. But there must be more. You're saying that this thing works? It looks extremely antiquated. Yes, it works. Together with the other pieces, that generates the energy. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I think there's really something to this. And I'm gonna track down the missing parts for Kala. Kala, I'd like you to return to base while I sort this out. Maddox, please bring Kala and Eduardo back to base. It won't take long. Ugh, more time wasting. I said please, Maddox. Let's keep it civil. This new diversion in search of completely unknown technology cannot be guaranteed to provide satisfactory results. All the same, Hive, I'm gonna follow my gut on this one. That's what I need. Kala has 
some knowledge of alien tech, and I think we could use the extra edge right now to ensure our survival. How long do you think this will take? Uh, hang on a sec. I just arrived at an outlaw hideout where one of the pieces of the puzzle's meant to be. Hey, you outlaws, listen up. You have something I want, and you are gonna hand it over now, or I blow your base to bits. Who the hell are you? What have we ever done to you? I'm gonna count to ten. Six. Seven. Hey, what happened to one of five? Eight, nine, ten. Anyway, Delia, I figured there's no point in negotiating, so I'm going in with guns blazing. Do what you must. Just stop tooling around and try to get back here before we have a fist fight on me. Please. I'll try to speed this up. I promise.
to Stardust. Exposed. Thanks, Ive. I know how this works. The outlaw station has jettisoned its entire inventory. Let's take a little look around for what we need. Only two more components left on the list for Kala's experimental tech. Ha! <laughs> got what I was looking for. Took longer than I expected. Maddox will be furious. I thought furious was Maddox's default mode.
Your unsteady docking procedure gave me some cause for concern. Hi, Tarjack. Sorry, I, uh, just blacked out for a minute. Weird flashbacks. Kind of personal, I suppose. You are experiencing hallucinations? I don't know what they are. Something glitching with me. Strange dreams when I least expect them. I really hope they don't kick in when I need to fight. Hmm. Such dreams can be deeper insights. It is believed by the Okar that certain celestial bodies can trigger visions and signal calamities to come. In any event, I wasn't expecting another shipment of gin. What brings you here? Or were you lost? Uh, no, I'm on other business. Do you remember being sold an alien component, a charred block with alien symbols? I was pointed in your direction. Mary DeVint sold me a trinket that fits that description some time ago. That's the one. I need it. I must say, I am a little perturbed by your entrance and your demands. It's complicated, hard to explain, but it's also important right now. You know, if I didn't know better, I'd say you've been touched by Eshahar. But I say too much. The bauble is yours. It has no discernible function. I have no idea why I kept it so long. Perhaps it was destined for this moment. That's actually very reasonable. Thank you, Tarjak. Be on your way. Just never say I didn't do you a good turn. Great. Now we only need to find one last component for Kala's experimental tech.
looking for a certain item. I was hoping you could help me. Let me see. Nope, we no longer have it. It already shipped out to Central Repository on Damaris Starport. What's that? Anything we have in stock that doesn't sell is taken into the repository until it's destroyed. Can't keep everything here. Could you help me track it down? I think I've already given you enough information. Can I see your G&B credentials? Ah, uh, never mind. I'll ask on Damaris myself. item I'm looking for has recently arrived on the starport in the latest G&B shipment. Here are the details. Well, the item in question is expected to arrive today, but you are a little too early. All right, I'll try again later.
alive, what are the chances that the component Kala's looking for is on that freighter? I see no other log of a GNB cargo freighter from Prescott to Dumaris in the recent time window. In which case, this automated shipment must contain the item in question. Well, if I was good, I'd just wait till it's docked and start negotiations. If I was good. Only now you bring morality into your decision making? item I'm looking for arrived with the freighter that just docked here? Oh yeah, the item just came in and has already been scanned for inventory. It can be made available to you for a processing fee. Okay, uh, how much is that then? 20,000 credits. What? That's a bit steep. Look man, the uh, processing fee is non-negotiable. You have got to be kidding me. Astralway robbery. I've been fleeced. Hope this is worth it. I have already warned you about the high unlikelihood of a satisfactory outcome to this folly. A satisfactory outcome to this folly? But shut up. So, let me see. I have the component from Tarjack, the part from GNB, and the part the outlaws took. That's the full shopping list. A collection of charred relics. I wonder how the strange alien can possibly make anything from these. Well, we're about to find out.
Kala, I got everything. I'd now like you to show me what all this is about. Once I put the pieces together, it can be used to create a rip that will let you jump through space and hopefully take me home. Sounds promising. I only hope it works. Oh, will you two please finish your damn yibber yabbing? Adam, I've waited long enough. We got a job to discuss. Now, on the bridge! Okay, all right, Maddox. So, you've all met Kala by now. Who will be staying with us until she finds her way home. It is an acquaintance to meet your pleasure. Almost. Yes. Well, now we have Eduardo here. Maddox is able to give us an update on the job at hand. Viridium! A veritable mountain of it. Just sitting in a comet and waiting for us to scoop it out of the sky. I've been waiting for this thing to come around for a long time. Finally, all the pieces have fallen into place. Eduardo, would you do the honors? There it is. Drink it in. Revisiting us in the DMZ after 15 years. One freighter load would be enough to make rich men, women, and uh, whatever's out of each of us. Only problem is that it's still a heck of a long way away, and might take some time to get there. Oh, hello. Our freaky little lady likes to play with maps. There, there, and there. Well, what do you know? Looks like our dearest new addition found us a shortcut already. <laughs> I knew she'd be useful. Considering she's not from this cluster, that's fairly impressive navigating. I do not know these stars, but I quickly find my way around. Interesting. Well, I'd like to propose we head out as soon as- I'm afraid I must object. You cannot carry out this mission. You do not understand the importance of Eshahar. Say, who, what, what now? This comet cannot be interfered with. I ask you to allow me a moment to explain. Now hold on there, mister. What is it, Tureen? What's the problem? What you see is an opportunity. What I see is something sacred to the Okar. Eshahar is of spiritual importance. Oh, here we go. Always the same. It's sacred to us, scrap from you damned Okar. I mean, I don't see the big problem with taking one little freighter load. No, I implore you. Okay, okay, hold on, everybody. Tareen, you don't seem to understand what this payday would mean for us. The riches from this comet is the ticket home we've all been waiting for. Eshahar is a holy comet. The Okar would not send a simple squadron to protect it. They would see its defacement as an act of war and send its entire fleet. Your actions are of bad portent, and the consequences could echo beyond anyone's control. I hate to say it, after everything we've gone through, but I think we need to take Tareen's warning seriously. Whoa, now, I've waited too long for this to be held back by some Okar superstition. But we don't want any reason to start a war with them either. I think I should at least investigate this. Maybe it's time to talk to Commissioner Hawk. I suspect she knows more about this than she's been letting on. Tareen, if you're right, this may be more explosive than any of us realize. What I saw in Vesna. The artifacts, the drilling equipment. It's all connected. Stay on the base until I get answers. The stakes are as high as I'm guessing. I don't want anybody jeopardizing things. You want to reveal our whole damn plan to the fleet? I didn't say that. I said I wanted to enlist her help. We might be teetering on the brink of a conflict that could wipe out the DMZ. Until I know what's happening, Maddox, stay away from the comet. I can't believe you would have the nerve to ground me, Adam. You know what this job is worth. Fifteen damn years I've waited. Even if there's the slightest possibility that Tarina's right, we can't take the chance of an all-out war in the DMZ. What do I care about another damn war? That's my fortune out there. I've waited too long for it already. Well, you wouldn't have gotten further than Avonrest without me. Consider that until I return. Hive, patch me through to Commissioner Hawk. Oh, it's you. I gave you this private connection only for extreme emergencies. This is important. 
We need to talk. It's about a comet. Not on the comms, if you please. No telling how secure even fleet frequencies can be. I am closing in on the demarcation line with the DMZ. I'll send you my coords. Meet me there as soon as possible. Until then, keep channels free and speak to no one. Damn, that's off my charts. I'll see what I can do. Over. I'll need to make it fast. I don't think we can hold down Maddox for too long. Kala, come in. This travel tech you had me pick up, does it really work? Yes, Clico. It joins two places by a connected rip. Having inspected the technology for myself, I have determined that it operates by finding a matching resonance between two astrographic points. This facilitates a spatial bypass of the two locations to momentarily manifest. The mechanics, I am still endeavoring to computate. Hmm, a spatial bypass. Interesting. If true, this could get me to the Commissioner faster. How about we try this thing out? If you're ready, let's begin. Hey, uh, Adam, are you busy? Am I busy? You mean other than the epic, ongoing drama somehow always pitched on the edge of war everyone's lives at risk? Yeah, other than that. Uh, no. Not really, I guess. Oh, good, thank you. Really, thank you. Because I was wondering, not that I want to be any trouble, but if you happen to have some time... What do you need, Alec? It's my kids. They're on my mind. Are they in trouble? Usually, yeah, but nothing to worry about. Evic's a mechanic, and Eric's a pilot, and then there's Emic and Edic and Ethic. Oh, and of course, Epic and Ezic, who have kids of their own now. Can you believe it? I'm a grandpa. Somehow, yes. And there's still all the others. Too many to get into right now. But it's been so long since I've had any word from any of them. And if you were to ever, you know, be in the area... Where are they? With their various moms, mostly on Avonrest, but it's the ones out at Coalition HQ and Drake System that I'm more concerned about. You could reach it through the hidden wormhole in Union. I don't know it. If you give me cords, I'll stop by and make sure they're all accounted for. Okie dokie. Cords are sent over. I'd go myself, but the Coalition told me to only show my face again if the cluster's about to implode. Appreciate it, dude. For you, Alec, I'd do anything. 